CPTV Sports is proud to introduce you to our first taste of the town. I'm Francesco Graziano Jr. I'm in Middletown on Main Street here to introduce you to some fine Thai cuisine. Our folks at the Middletown Press introduced us to Thai Gardens and we're really excited to eat some of this Thai food today. The Thai Gardens represent a great culture spot in Middletown. Everything is handmade from the paintings to the pillows. The booths are situated close to the floor, representative of the seating in a Thai household. Si Kam Singh is the hostess at this restaurant. You guys, I'm told, have the best Asian cuisine in Middletown. I would have to agree. <laughs> What's your specialty? Yes. Uh, our duck is very, very good, crispy duck. And also, the students love pad thai, which is our noodle dish, and drunken noodles. Mm -hmm. But what I have to ask you most, do you think that these dishes are good enough to satisfy a whole football team like we have playing earlier tonight here on uh, CPTV Sports. Absolutely. The chefs at Thai Gardens recommended I eat Pad Thai. This is a dish made popular during the 1930s. The dish consists primarily of noodles, egg, scallions, bean sprouts, tofu, crushed peanuts, and lime. Okay, the executive chef, Luntia, and the owner, she is gonna be cooking one of our fam famous dish, Pad Thai. Putting in the oil at the moment just to get the wok hot and steamy for the noodles. I want to add that she looks absolutely beautiful in that stunning wardrobe. She said she didn't know that we were coming today, but I have to think that she's always cooking with class. That's right, and she just put in the sauce, which is a sweet pad thai sauce. With pad thai, you can add any type of meat you want chicken, beef, pork, and also shrimp. But that's what you're going to be having today shrimp. I'm a big fan of shrimp. What's left to do here? Just stir frying it all together. Once she gets it on the plate, we'll get it nice and pretty. All right. Not as pretty as she is. Or yourself. Why, thank you. Students from nearby Wesleyan University flock to Thai Gardens for Pad Thai. The dish can be prepared in just a few minutes to accommodate the rush. Reviewers from the New York Times once called it tender and in top form. The dish comes out through here. Give you a little bit of lime, some Spice tofu. It up just a bit. Okay. Look at that shrimp. Peanut, Spices. crushed peanuts, a little bit of texture, scallions on top for dressing, and some bean sprouts. Who doesn't love bean sprouts, right? That's There's it. There's a lot of different ingredients in here. What should I be most excited about? I would say the noodles. You're gonna love the taste of the noodles. And now the peanut, always a big ingredient in Thai cuisine. Right, right. Why is that? It gives it a nice buttery taste. This makes it all up in there, you'll like it. The crunchiness of the sprouts, a little bit of lime over it for the seafood. There's just so much going on, I can't wait to actually just put it in my mouth and just get rid of it off this plate. Now it's the first time I'm trying Thai cuisine. I've actually had Asian cuisine many times, but Thai, really excited about. I see we have some peanuts in here, the shrimp, and the sauce intrigues me more than anything. There's some sugar and water in it, but also some paprika and some soy sauce, so let's dig in. I'm glad I waited to try it so that all the folks at home can see just how good it is. So this is our first Taste of the Town segment that we did for CPTV Sports. And Thai Gardens really did give us that chance to promote some of the best food that Middletown has to offer. And I would back them up any day of the week.